the tank that we'll use for refueling. You're on air! All right. Well, I guess we better hit this gavel, huh, Ernie? This is uh, the April 13th meeting uh, of the Board of Appeals. We're going to call it to order. And would everyone stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. So, Pat's been caught up in traffic. She does plan to be here, but we have a quorum sitting here, and uh, I don't think there's any real need to introduce the Members, we have the name plaques in front, um, and I think everyone knows us by now. We don't have much business, formal business. We have a workshop scheduled after this, but um, we want to approve the minutes of January 12th. I believe those are in our packet, and uh, if you need, take a second to peruse through these. Uh, it was a while back, and... Uh, after everyone's comfortable with the minutes. Yeah, and I don't, I'm not sure why I put in findings of fact on there, but I'll cross it out and fix the agenda. Well, it's not a problem. We're, uh, going to try to get ahead of these minutes and uh, because tonight's minutes will only be approving these minutes we're going to approve those as well so that we can actually not have to deal with trying to catch up so is everyone comfortable with the minutes as presented in draft form for January 12th 2022 I find it acceptable. I move we accept. We've got a motion to accept. We've got second. a second. Further discussion? All in favor? Motion passes. <clears throat> We've approved the minutes from January 12th. So, Tammy, we have no old business. I'm, is that correct? That is correct. All right. So, I can't think we want to just move ahead to basically approving these minutes with the three of us here basically just saying that we approve the minutes can so, we can we do informational items first oh sure I just skipped right over that I yep. wasn't even thinking let's do those so I wanted to let everybody know that there is an SMPDC Southern Maine um, well, Planning and Development Commission is going to come down and put on a boardsmanship workshop and I have requested that they also take and address how important it is for all members of any board here in Berwick to take and follow the ordinance. We know everybody has an opinion. We know everybody has feelings. But this type of boardsmanship, you have to be able to take and separate the two. Simply because if you let your feelings run your ordinance, you have no idea what you're going to be getting one applicant could be treated differently than another applicant and everything this way if everybody follows the ordinance which is what you have to determine when somebody comes back before you well, for an appeal for an appeal correct so it would be nice if you could all clear your calendars for monday may 2nd at 6 30 p.m and if i can get everybody in here it'll be here Otherwise, it'll be recorded upstairs in the auditorium. I have both locations reserved at the moment. Time on so that is? 6.30. Yeah, I, and I think what you mentioned is if you follow the ordinance, if you're not following the ordinance, as soon as the board changes over, then it could go off in a different direction depending exactly. on what the opinion of that particular yeah. member, new member of the board is. Yeah. Because board. I know when people even come in to see me, it's like you want to do what, where? You know, I have to be careful that I don't react like that, that I keep my personal opinions behind me, and I have to follow the ordinance. 
no matter which town I've worked in for it, I have to follow that ordinance. I can't take Berwick's to Lyman, to Peru, to wherever. Right. I have to use their ordinance. I so. a good example of that is that we're asking the public to um, follow certain procedures in the application. And not only that, when it comes to presentation, we're looking for facts, we're looking for evidence, we're looking to have pictures, et cetera, et cetera. So if we expect the public to have a certain, this is, this is a cooperative effort. Yep. We as a board also have to be unified and follow certain rules without prejudice. Correct. Very, very true. Yep. So I, Absolutely. I thought that that would be very appropriate with some of the new members and a Board of Appeals that actually wants to learn and know their ordinance and what they can do and how they can help people. That's the, that's the point that I'm hoping will come through at this workshop. They're also going to go over the different types of appeals and meetings, the quasi-judicial and things like that. They're going to cover Robert's rules on a, on a higher level. But if I remember correctly, SMPDC is very good at putting together paperwork so that I can make copies, provide them to everybody, and you can have them as reference material. So I let Lee J know today that if we need to make copies, I would offer to do those for our group. So he doesn't have to bring them with him and things of that nature. So Good. So I'm, I'm hoping we can get a good, almost every board to come in and do it. So, but that's all I have. I did Chair, notice. Can I, can, I, oh, Chair, can, I, can I have a question? Absolutely. Um, how are we coming on getting new members, or I say new, more members on this board? Because one of the things that we look, we're looking at is to make, see if we can get. Um, <clears throat> That's going to be discussed at the workshop. Okay. So it's, it's on the workshop for just that reason, so we can work as a team to be okay. able to do it. I know that's one of our goals. Is yep. Yep. And Tammy, I noticed that you have uh, the Borough Board of Appeals Policies and Procedures draft here. Is that something that... Um, is going to be in the workshop. It'll be in the workshop as well? Yep. Okay. Yep. Perfect. I put your workshop information with your yep. agenda in minutes. So. Excellent. So we have no more informational items so that gets us down once again to approving the minutes for today um, I think it's pretty much set up so that uh, Tammy can fill in the information as provided um, so uh, having said that is there is everyone all okay with the minutes as presented Let's make a motion to approve the minutes for tonight Okay, so we got the motion to approve the minutes of April 13th tonight. Ernie, you got a second on that? Yeah, I'll second that. Got a second? Further discussion? No. All in favor? Motion passes. So we've approved the minutes. Now, I think that gets us to adjournment. Is that true? Correct. All right. So I guess I need a motion to adjourn this meeting and move into the workshop. So moved. Second. Second. Further discussion? All in favor to adjourn the meeting. Motion passes.